Hello and welcome to the session. In this session first we will discuss about chance. In our day to day life we come across several situations. Some of them may be certain to happen. Some of them are impossible to happen. And some of those situations may or may not happen. And the situations that may or may not happen has a chance of happening. So like if we toss a coin, we may either get a head or a tail. We cannot always correctly predict that we will get a head or a tail. And it is the matter of chance. That in one particular throw, we get either head or tail. Now when we throw a die, we cannot predict the number that will be obtained on throwing a die we would get the numbers 1 or 2 or 3 or 4 or 5 or 6 and it is matter of chance that we get the number of our wish Consider the statement Ram winning the match According to this statement Ram may either win the match or he may lose the match So both these situations are possible so this situation has some chance of happening. Next we discuss probability. Now when we toss a coin, we may get either a head or a tail. That is when a coin is thrown, it has two possible outcomes, head or tail. And these two outcomes, head and tail, are equally likely possible outcomes and so probability of getting head would be equal to the probability of getting tail and each would be equal to 1 upon 2. Now the events which have many possibilities can have probability between 0 and 1, then the events which have no chance of happening will have probability 0 and those events which are bound to happen will have probability 1. It is not necessary that in every situation the outcomes that we get have equal chances of occurring. Let's consider the statement Sun rises in the east. Now this event is bound to happen so we say the probability for this one would be 1.
So this completes the session. Hope you have understood the concept of chance and probability.